This is our double reed coyote howler. Another easy call to blow. The harder you blow, the more it, uh, easier it is to control. I'm just blow him. Just blowing as hard as you can on this makes a great sounding coyote howl. It's going to run this call like every other diaphragm call. Make sure it fits into the roof of your mouth, fits your palate. Everybody's sort of unique that way, so don't be afraid to bend the aluminum frame. You don't ever want to kink it. It's just a nice smooth bend. You can take the tape off if you have to to help it seal up more. And then you're just blowing on this call as, as hard as you can. The harder you blow, the higher pitch you get. And then to end it, just drop your jaw. You want to run this double reed coyote howler. Uh, use it as a locator probably to start off because you have uh, a lot of volume so you can locate, you can get the coyotes to answer you and then you can sort of play the wind once you get them to answer you. So it helps, it helps you to get set up and uh, the curiosity factor is, is uh, part of it also. But you can tone this call down and you can call them the whole way in with this call. You don't need a whole lot of calls. This, this will also tone down. But the main thing for this call is to locate or to challenge them and get you set up to move in for the kill. When using these calls, if you want to be a lot more effective, you want to use the wind to your advantage. So if you have a coyote answer you way downwind, he's going to want to come up and get downwind of you and usually they'll do that within a hundred yards they might they're not going to get right on top of you before they do that this we're talking about an animal with a very high sense of smell and uh, he's very aware of everything that's going on so he's going to want to come in downwind of you and usually that's a hundred yards or more so when i'm setting up on the coyote i'm going to want to go downwind of my calling position and try to get a vantage point where i can see a hundred yards at the intersection of where he's going to try to come and get downwind of me so we're going to have a, a better uh, advantage on him if we can see a long ways. We don't want to get in a tight spot and start calling and never know what happens. So we want to be able to see and you want to be able to definitely play the wind. These diaphragm type calls is a, your most economical way to get into any type of calling really, but for predators they are great. It allows you to get a lot of volume, tone it down, you can do a wide range of distress to how. A lot of different calls you can make on this diaphragm call. And uh, you don't got to spend a lot of money. For 20 bucks, you can have a complete set of diaphragm calls that'll get the job done for you uh, no matter what the situation is.